16 right now. It's July, and that means a lot of football practice is just around the corner for student athletes. Doctors say, listen to this, about 100 young athletes drop dead every year. Dr. Kevin Campbell here this morning with more. Doc, good to see you. Good to see you, Phil. What's the most common reason for this, the common cause? The most common reason for athletes falling dead is sudden cardiac death related to a dangerous heart rhythm called ventricular fibrillation. In the U.S., a thickened heart, a condition called hypertrophic cardiomyopathy, account for almost 50 percent of mm. these, and these can be picked up through routine screening tests. Well, talk about that. Talk about uh, you know detecting it early and the routine test itself. What we know now and what the American Heart Association recommends is that every high school athlete has a pre-participation physical exam. That should include a history where your doctor asks you questions about your history and the family history and a good exam where they listen to your heart and lungs and make sure that you're okay. There's some debate about this. Right. Uh, in Europe, the European Society of Cardiology said we should do an EKG test where we measure your heart rhythm mm. through an EKG. The AHA says no. However, new data has just come out that shows that if we use EKGs, we actually pick up more of these potential deadly conditions. Specifically in, in, in high school and college athletes as well, right? Those standards are changing too. Exactly. What we think is based on a study that was released very recently that the AHA may actually revise their guidelines. This study showed that if we added an electrocardiogram or EKG test, to the history and physical exam that we picked up 30 percent mm. more of these abnormalities and then you can counsel that child and their parents about participating in sports and keep them safe. Yeah, uh, about 45 seconds left. If you're a parent out there, what should you know? What should you be thinking about to keep your child safe? First of all, make sure your child knows if they're having symptoms of shortness of breath, chest pain, they need to tell their coach or another adult. If they have any episodes of passing out, you definitely need to see a cardiologist and be screened for for these dangerous conditions because one of the symptoms of a dangerous heart rhythm is to lose consciousness. Make sure that your child plays hard but also plays safe. No doubt about that and this is your specialty. You are a cardiologist. Absolutely. Dr. Kim Campbell, really Thank good to you. see you. Of course, if you have a question for Dr. Kim Campbell, really easy. Log on to our website, WNCN.com. Search links we mentioned. From there, you can find Dr. Campbell's website or you can like his Facebook page and even follow him on Twitter.